model railroad crossing signal that I built. I just finished it. It is uh, made from PVC pipe, PVC sheets, stainless steel shot glass or something. Um, I got a little chrome knob that I hacked apart made for the bell on top and I've got an oscillator, a 555 oscillator inside I got a 4017 decade counter um, I got, let's see, uh, the 9 volt battery drives the oscillator these two AAA batteries, they drive the solenoid for making the bell ring. And the project took me all oh, probably 15, 15 or so hours. This is not something I really planned out. It was just to wing it because I told my son, I was like, I will build you one of those sometime. And he's really big into the, the crossing signals. For whatever reason, that's his thing. So, um, let's see if I can. I get this solenoid dinging the cup. And I'm really happy with how these lights came out. They're just LEDs, clear LEDs, and they're buried in hot milk glue and I was really fortunate to get the bubbles in there sometimes it comes out really clear but they look like they look like lenses um, they, they, I'm really impressed with how those things came out um, so yeah I used some galvanized flashing just as a it's kind of a casing. I didn't really, really want to put a casing around the whole thing. I should have made the base a little bit bigger. But there again, I winged this whole thing. So, uh, yeah. And that's it. I know my son is going to have a lot of fun with it because he's obsessed with railroad crossings. <laughs>